Hey, this is Ariel Levine for Enter Talk Radio, and I'm sitting here with Eric Lucero of Pitbull Audio, and we're checking out some guitars. Eric, what is this mysterious and fantastic beast that I have in front of me? This uh, shred beast you have in front of you is a Skurvison Raptor 7 in a multi-scale format here. It's got a, a swamp ash body with a quadruple A flamed maple top, a uh, ebony fretboard. It's got a bare knuckle nail bomb in the bridge. What's and, that? The pickup? Oh uh, yeah, yeah. Bare knuckle is a English pickup company, and a nail uh, the nail bomb is one of their high output pickups. And as you can see on the fretboard there, it's got the V frets, the multi scale, and it's, a nice pointed head. It's got a stake for yes. uh, stabbing supernatural creatures who are coming in after you. Yeah, if you're gonna slay dragons on stage, you might as well have something with a pointed edge. I will say, like I, this this kind of guitar is way beyond the scope of my abilities and and out of my you know playing wheelhouse style, especially with a fanned neck. I've heard of these for years. I've never actually held one. Uh, what I like about this so far is that it's super lightweight. Yeah. And it, it, it's a big neck because it's a seven string guitar with an extra baritone string there, but it doesn't feel totally wrong to hold the neck. I think personally for me, getting used to, oh yeah, first, three, first of all, getting used to a seven string and getting used to the fan, that it's like, it's like learning a new instrument entirely and having to kind of relearn how to play, but it's kind of neat. I mean, look at the back of this thing. I mean, it's just somebody really likes wood. So what's it, where's this company from? Uh, Skurvison is a Polish company, and yeah. all their guitars are handmade. So this yeah. is a hand-carved instrument here. It's real. Yeah, it it's it's fantastic. It feels very handmade. It feels very raw. Like it's it's not finished, which is kind of cool. You know, I think this is a guitar for people who really appreciate wood, and obviously who appreciate this kind of. That kind of playing style, which again is not my thing, and I'm gonna do my best to like make my way through it now. But let's uh. See that I understand that it's built for somebody who goes like this, you know. And I will say, like, again, not my kind of guitar, but the way the, the pickup's great, it's like high output, you know, crispy, chimey. Is it's I mean, I'd, love it. I'd love that pickup. Also, I got a coil tap on that as well. How do I access Push that? pull on that. Oh, look at that. All right, I'm having fun. It's squawky, it's squirrely. I mean, it sounds great. I mean, and you know, credit to to the guitar builder. I'm sure a lot of it has to do with the, with the wood and the fact that it's it's got this really. You know, it's Swamp Ash? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Favorite of the builders these days. Swamp Ash, it's lightweight. I mean, that's your classic Telecaster. Yeah. Wood, too. Yeah, yeah, Ash Bodies. And that is definitely a coil tap, because you can hear that single coil. Yeah. Yeah, yeah nothing that a very noise gate would take care of, but still, I mean, this fantastic. And locking tuners. Yeah, at the bridge of tuners are by hip shot. And I haven't even, like, dive, dove into the... Basically, have a baritone guitar, you know, and your standard. Yeah, the the uh, bass half, the top half here is uh, bottom half is a 27 inch scale, and then on the treble half of it, it's uh, your standard strat scale, 25 and a half inch. So it's actually like this is a baritone scale, and that's a strat scale. You got it. Oh, that's kind of nifty. <laughs> I'm like a little bit converted. Like I don't know if you'll see me on stage with one of these like anytime soon, but maybe in the future. Like I, I kind of dig it. I don't know. Thanks for showing this to me, Eric. Anytime, man. This is Ariel Levine for Enter Talk Radio, and this has been another Pitbull Audio Gear Preview.